Hello everyone, in today's video I will show you how to, how to bypass and remove uh, Google and Samsung account from every Samsung phone with latest security patch from November 2019. Just uh, watch the video carefully and follow the steps carefully and you need a lot of patience and one of the steps. Ok, let's start. You can see the phone is locked, we can't enter the menu, so we need to factory reset the phone. How we are doing this? By entering the recovery and wipe data from there. For that purpose, we need to turn on the, the screen, hold volume down plus power button until the phone turns off and when the phone turns off, we immediately need to move our fingers on the Bixby button, volume up button and power button. I will show you. So turn on the screen, hold volume down plus power. The phone is off and we move our fingers to volume up, Bixby and power. Ok, we are now in the recovery menu, from here, move the cursor with the volume buttons and select wipe data factory reset and confirm with power button, select yes and wait the phone to full map itself, ok, it's done and now select reboot system now. Okay, the phone boots, it's ready, we need to select our language, and let's start. Skip this for now, you can see an authorized attempt has been made to reset your device to factory default settings. Connect to a Wi-Fi or mobile network to verify your identity. Ok, here we are connecting to network. Next. And you can see the phone is asking for pin code, we don't know it. If we tap on here, you can see device was reset. So, what we are doing now, go back here at the step with the Wi Fi network. It's important to be here. And what we need now is a SIM card, pin code enabled. And just here is the step where you need to be very patient. Follow the step exactly, make it once, twice or, or how many times it need to be, it will happen, just need to be patient. Okay. Eject the SIM. Putting the, the SIM locked SIM card here and don't pull the tray to the end like this. Now what we need to do is put the SIM eject tool here.
with, uh, with one of the hands, push the seam tray, after you need to count one, two, three and tap next, after that immediately push the seam eject tool to eject the seam card, tap OK, tap here on the notification and slide here with your finger. You need to do this quickly. OK. OK. Push the tray, one, two, three, tap next. Push the tray, here, here. We need to be faster. OK. Again. Push the tray, one, two, three, tap next, eject, here, here, more faster. Okay, push, one, two, three, next. Okay, push, one, two, three, next, eject, here, here, we don't catch it, and we need to try again. And that's what we need guys. Finally we catch it. Okay guys, we finally reach uh, the notification uh, bar. That's what we need. Just be patient. I made it probably 30 or 40 times until I reach it. And from here is the easy part of the unlock. Just tap on the search icon and tap on settings. Okay, that was easy. We'll tap here on lock screen and security. You can see it's here screen lock type swipe what we need to do now is just go back biometrics and security face recognition ok confirm and enter a pin 4 digit pin wherever you prefer ok it's ready now just go back Now if we are going to lock screen, you can see screen lock type is pin. From here, just hold the power button and select restart. And wait the phone to restart. Okay. The phone restarts, you can see the lock screen, if we swipe up, the phone asks for PIN that we entered previously, so mine is four zeros, ok, ok, let's go, next, skip this for now, here we are already connect. Now the phone is checking for updates. Okay, enter your current pin. Okay, we are entering four zeros and next. And that's all guys, we are ready. We can skip this step now. Okay. everything skip skip and we are at the home screen the phone is unlocked and ready now I will go to settings just show you about phone software information you can see here Android security patch level is from November 1st, 2019. Okay, this is the latest security patch.
this is the latest update and everything's fine work our method is work perfectly and we are ready if you prefer now you can go to general management reset and factory data reset reset it enter your pin next and delete all that's it guys thanks for watching my video if the video helps you please like like it and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this thank you and have a nice day